What's good YouTube? In this video we'll be taking a look at the pro photography options on the Samsung S22 Ultra. If you like this kind of content, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching. So the Samsung S22 Ultra is one of the most advanced camera clusters available on a smartphone that Samsung has manufactured yet. And it has a lot of options, probably too many options to list here in one single video or too many options for Samsung to market to the masses. And the pro photography mode is one of those modes that has a variety and myriad of options and adjustments that are that might not be too well known. This video will go over all the options in the pro photography mode. If you have trouble accessing pro photography mode or you don't know how to act, it's not available on your phone, check out my link in the video in the description below for a way, a walkthrough of how to activate or enable pro photography mode on the S22 Ultra. So with pro photography mode enabled and in pro photography mode on the camera app, there's a few options we can go over. So with the UI here, you can see that on the left, we have an adjustment for ISO. Here you can change the ISO on your, your phone using the horizontal slider. Next we have of course shutter speed, that's right next to ISO. And there, from there you can also adjust the focus from auto to manual. And next to that, you can, of course, adjust the white balance also using the horizontal slider. This comes in handy, particularly if you're shifting from environment to environment with different lighting conditions and colors. These are the options available at the bottom of the screen on photography mode. Right above there, you can switch between the different lenses on available to you from the camera cluster on the S22 Ultra. This goes from ultra wide, wide, telephoto, to super telephoto, which is 10 times magnification. At the top of the screen are some further adjustments that aren't available to you in the normal mode. Here at the top right, you can hit that little button to adjust different sliders like tint, highlights, shadows, saturation, and again, tint. This comes in handy, particularly if you don't want to do much pro post-processing and you'd like to adjust the image quality of your photo right from your phone. Next to these adjustments, you can change whether or not this it's center, center weighted metering, matrix metering, or spot metering. And next to there, you can, much like the other photography modes through the camera app, you can adjust the aspect ratio. 3 fourths, 9 sixteenth, 1 to 1, or full. Next to that is the timer, and of course next to that is the flash, which are features available through other modes on the camera app on the S22 Ultra. So overall, the pro photography mode gives you a lot more quick access to things like white balance, saturation, tint, and contrast that you can adjust on the fly prior to taking your capture. It really does come in handy as the pro photography mode and the lens system on the S22 Ultra can really result in some amazing captures. So there you have it everyone, just a quick overview of some of the options available to you in pro photography mode on the S22 Ultra. If you like this kind of content, leave a message down below. Don't forget to subscribe and thanks for watching.